Rushing and total offense and a heart-stopping loss to BYU. Today, Bill Musgrave and the high-powered Ducks seek to keep their bowl hopes alive against the UCLA Bruins. Oregon football coming up next. game featuring the Oregon Ducks versus the UCLA Bruins. Oregon Duck football is brought to you by Highmark, where it's like a sale every day. By State Farm Insurance, like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. By Budweiser, for all you do, this month's for you. By your Northwest Jeep Eagle dealer, where you can always expect the best. By the Oregon Lottery. Join the action. Play the lottery sports action game. By Rubenstein, the largest seller of quality furniture in the Pacific Northwest. By Wood Products Credit Union. Build your future with us. Live from the Rose Bowl in Pasadena, it's Oregon football. This afternoon, the Ducks take on the UCLA Bruins. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Todd McKim, along with Greg Moser, and welcome to this afternoon's contest. Normally, when the month of November rolls around, the UCLA is chasing a postseason bowl invitation. The Ducks struggling to get back to or over the 500 mark. And Greg, this year, roll reversal. The Ducks come in with a record of five and four. UCLA has lost four in a row and are three and six. They really are. But when you look at them as three and six, it's not really what you would assume a three and six ball club. They've lost several games by very close margins and if a couple plays go either way during those games they could very well be six and three or seven and two so it's a very good UCLA team they've had some inexperience at quarterback that's given some problems in their consistency but they are very good on defense and if offensively they get some things going they're gonna be very tough well the Ducks had a great offensive game a week ago at BYU but they lost the contest 45 to 41 Greg an emotional loss a tough loss how do they bounce back this afternoon I think after a good week of practice and knowing that they still do have a chance at at least an outside chance at postseason games coming in with this game and the next game a good showing here that's got to be some incentive and this is a team that uh, Oregon team has not won seven games in 20 years so if they do that that should be incentive enough to get things right back and the offense played great the defense just has to regroup and try to stop this UCLA team it will take a total team effort as for the keys to the contest let's hear from coach Rich Brooks well I think uh, Obviously, early on, it will be whether we're able to contain UCLA's running game. They're very physical, as you know, with a, a big, huge, very talented offensive line and three very fast tailbacks and big monsters at fullback that can roll you over. So I think our ability to, to keep stay on the line of scrimmage on defense, which we've done pretty well almost every game this year, uh, that will be a major key for us because we're able to control their running situations. I think we can get in and do some things against their passing game. That remains to Testing be seen one, if the Ducks two, can three, do that. Yeah. It is a warm day here in Pasadena, and the weather is nice as far as the sun is concerned, but the air quality is not the greatest, so we'll see how that affects the Ducks this afternoon. When we come back, we will have the starting lineups and the opening kickoff, the Ducks against the UCLA Bulls. 